Hey guys, I want to talk to you a little bit about how you can tweak your fishing outfits just a tiny bit to make it more convenient when you're out on the water. Now these are two outfits that are perfect together. Now we've got this Akuma Rio with a Phoenix rod and another one with the California rod. And both of these rods don't come with any place to put your jig or your hook when you're in between stops. So what I've done is put a little zip tie here and this is a cable strap one. So it has a hole in it there where you would put a screw to put it into a wall or something like that. But I use that little hole in there to uh, put my jigs on and put my hooks on. So when the boat is sitting there and we're traveling, I put the rod in the rack, the jig fits right there, and I don't have to worry about it coming loose. And you can see how easily that works where you just take the jig, slide it right into the hole there, and now your jig is nice and safe. You tighten up the line a little bit and you know you don't have to put it on a guide and tear up a guide. So if you don't know how to do this, let me show you really simple how to do it. You just take a, a cable tie, they're called. It's basically a zip tie, but it has that loop in it. And you just slide it onto your rod. Now, I like to use the black ones, but for demonstration purposes, I have a white one here. And you just tighten it down and you're done. Take your dights, cut off the excess. And then what I do is just slide this back so it's not in the way while I'm fishing. And when I want to go ahead and put the jig on it, I just slide it out there like that. Connect the bucktail or my hook or whatever it is right there. And my lure or my hook is secured and everyone's safe on the boat. And I have all ready to go for next time. A lot of you like to take your jigs and your hooks and put them right up on the guides, but it messes up the finish and it really beats up the guide. It's not a good thing to do. So having a little tie wrap like this or a cable tie like that on your rod makes it nice and convenient. In the old days, all the rods came with them. And it just seems like over the years, as people cut back and stuff on production, uh, they don't make these anymore. You can have a store put them on for you, a custom store. But uh, just using a little zip tie like that costs you a couple of pennies and it works out really nice. You can find them in the stores in different colors. Home Depot has them in all kinds of different colors. Basic ones are red and white, but if you want a blue one, I'm sure you can find a blue one out there. So that's just a little tickle, tackle tip, a little uh, tip to help you out when you're out on the water. And we'll be giving you more of these this year. 2017, we have lots of videos coming your way. Every Thursday, I'm gonna be doing a video blogs for you. Put them right here on my YouTube channel and give you more tips and information to help you become a better angler. Well, thanks for watching. Don't forget, if you ever want to join me on the water, I do private charters on my own boat and the TV filming trips. You can see all those dates available on our website at sport-fishing.com. And right here on my YouTube channel, there's over 1,200 videos with lots of tips and information to help you catch fish. Well, thanks again for watching. I'll talk to you all really soon.